Okay, guys, I'm gonna be teaching you how to jailbreak your iPod or iPhone. Okay, as you can see here, it's a, I restored my iPod. Nothing fancy about it yet. Okay. Make sure it's connected. Okay. I'm just gonna turn mine off. Whatever, like that. Okay. So, what you're gonna wanna do? I'm gonna post this link on the description later. It's mega upload, and you just put in that code or whatever code it's gonna be, and you press download. Oh, didn't take it. Okay. Okay. This is gonna take about 45 seconds to download, or at least wait until it gets the download then when it says free download you click on that and then it should look something like that that little lego looking block thing right there okay then once that's done i already have it installed so it makes it out and then what you're gonna do so if you're a mac user well this video is mostly for mac users but you're gonna hold down shit you're gonna hold down option you're gonna go to check for update. You're gonna hold down option, and you're gonna click it. Okay. Once that's up, you click that file. You should should it should be on desktop. This one right there. If not, then drag it onto your desktop. Okay. It's gonna extract the software, and I'm gonna pause it right here. Okay, guys. Okay. So, once you're done getting the 1.1 .1 on your iPod, then go to Safari and go to jailbreakme.com. jailbreakme.com This should pop up app stop app snap installer for 1.1.1 Okay. Go all the way down to the bottom and press that one right there. Install app snap. It should crash. Okay. Once it crashes, it'll download. Try to unlock. Then you get this new app right here called Installer. Click on that. It's going to refresh. Then don't worry about that. Just press Donate later. Uh, install. Go down all the way to Tweaks 1.1.1. Uh, press OK to prep. Make sure you do not install anything else besides OK to prep. It says you are now ready to perform an update to 1.1.2 and continue with the, with the touch free process. Just press OK. Then press the home button. Then you can just slide it unlock. There's no visual changes. So after that, I'm just going to turn it off quick. Make sure it's still connected. And you're going to go to this. I'll put it in the description, the link. And you're going to click on this. And it'll download. But since I already have it, I don't need to. And then just, you should get a file. Hold on. You should get a file that looks like this. It only has these in it. 
but I already took it out, so it's the only one that you're really going to need is the one that says jailbreak jar. It has like a coffee mug on it, okay? So I'm going to exit out of that. You're just going to double click on jailbreak jar. And it says, welcome to the touch-free process. The jailbreak for the firmware version 1.2. 1.1.2 is brought to you by iPhone Touch Dev, blah 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 Before clicking the magic button, please make sure that you already used OK to prep in 1.1.1 and have now updated to 1.1.2 So what you're going to do before you press jailbreak is you're going to press update and it's going to extract the software I'm going to pause it right okay. Okay, so once it's done extracting the software, you're going to go back to that jailbreak jar, and double click it. But before you do anything else, make sure you close out of iTunes. I mean, quit it. Quit it. Okay? Okay. Once it's at, once it's quit, Make sure your iPod's still connected and go install SSH and then hit the jailbreak button. And this box should pop up. Okay, it's going to take um, about a little over two minutes, but it's okay. So, I'm going to cut it right here. Okay. So, once the jailbreak jar is completed, then you're all done. All you have to do is slide to unlock. And you should have SSH in there. What you want to do is hit install. If you want iPhone apps, then, then follow the rest of the video. Go to sources. And go to edit. Add. Then you're going to type in repo. R E P O dot U S dot T O repo dot uh, dot U S dot T O and then press OK. This shouldn't take that long. And just press update now if you want to, it doesn't matter. Okay. Now press install. Go down to phone iPhone 1.1.1. First download all the preps first. There only should be two preps. Then go back. Then you just install the rest of them. Then once you download all these, you can download whatever you want. Just and if you want, you could um, comment me and or send me a message telling me what you want me to do. But I do not do those um, rapid share things where you have to do it on the computer. I don't like doing stuff on the computer only. If I'm jailbreaking it, but 
I don't like adding apps from the computer. So just message me or do something and just tell me what you what you would like to see in my next upcoming video for the iPod Touch jailbreaking. Then just press the home button. That'll pop up and just slide to unlock and they should be there. There's there's stocks. There's your installer, there's your mail, there's notes, and then there's weather and maps. And they all work. Notes. I'm going to press the home button. I'm going to mail and just set up an account.